Hello, everybody. Not unlike an unquiet spirit of a drowned child, we find ourselves drawn inexorably back, unable to escape from the lake house. Children of Silence, we're your hosts. I'm Michael. I'm Amanda. Did you say inextralibly? Inexorably? Inexorably. Apparently, this one's going to come with a link to a Merriam-Webster's dictionary <laughs> because we're, we're going to not only help you find obscure objects in illustrated tableaus, but also build your vocabulary at the same time. I think that would be a fun idea for a hidden object game, actually, is... Is a dictionary? <laughs> <laughs> Find these words on this page. Hint, they're in alphabetical order. Uh, considering how you've been complaining about some of this gameplay, I think you would find a dictionary more fun. Let's do that next time. Instead but... <laughs> of picking up another one of these games, let's just better ourselves. Oh, we don't have to pick up more of these games. I have, like, a hundred, so... There's We're never gonna only run. hundreds to go. We're never going to run out. All right, burned house and a room is where there is stuff to do. All right, go there. And my idea was that you would look up, like, uh, synonyms for common object names, like, uh, I'm not going to be able to think of any when I'm on the spot, but... Right, right, right. It's all coming back. So one of the puzzles that we stopped at here is a quartet of statues that need their musical instruments. Uh, we know where there's a garbage cello in some mud. All we have to do is turn ourselves into is it a luthier. There's another <laughs> vocabulary term for, term for you. I think that's the name of somebody who makes stringed instruments. Yes. Might just be someone who makes violins, but we'll find out. That's a hidden object inside a dictionary for you to go look up. <laughs> Percussionist needs a triangle. Right, we oh, right. saw one. We saw the in a triangle vase. that needs to be fixed. Cotton a vice. Why did I say vase? Oh, we have a violin bow. Oh, well, that's. Fixed. Do we have anything else that we completely forgot about? Does anyone want to change their instrument to a gun? <laughs> I'd better not do that. Mm -hmm. What if he decides to play it? Okay, it says. Well, that that was probably the something we can do here, and yeah, now it's time to go back to room. <laughs> so let's go back to room. Okay, now I have an example, so I'm going to explain the rest of my idea. All right. Which is like, and this is a, a an easier one, but like to have your hidden object scene, right? And then you would have the names of the items, but then they would all be sort of fancy synonyms for the items, like philodendron at the bottom. And you'd be like, what's, I think I know what that is. Maybe it's a plant. But if you clicked on the word, like you gave up then it would go fern and you could just look for a fern but if you were like smart you could look for it by the complicated um vocabulary and then you would get like bonus points except that where this falls down is that hidden object games don't really typically give you points so i guess it would just have to be a, a moral satisfaction of having done the harder part the harder thing Really? Yeah, just like in the picture right here. Oh! You know how when you buy a music box, you never throw out the instructions because, who knows, <laughs> you might accidentally take your flower completely out of your trailer home <laughs> and across half a swamp and then just leave it somewhere where it can be chewed on by a hedgehog? I don't even remember where we found this thing. Alright, so you got your thing now. Still, do we have a... Lily! Oh, the music box key. Well, Alright. Didn't actually play a song. Nope. It looks like a music box, but it's just another lock. So there's the cello string we need. And apparently we can't steal jewelry. Aw. Bummer, man. Uh, we know that it's worthless. We've got to get an eye for these things. Ah, right. We've stolen enough stuff over the course of this game that we, know <laughs> we can recognize the quality. We were watching, by the way, a horror movie last night. Um, which was actually really good. It was called Resolution. Mm -hmm. um, like a, an indie movie that was doing a lot with a little uh, budget. Um, and it was really nicely written and good, good stuff. But like, there were so many scenes of this protagonist wandering around in places just like looking at stuff, finding things, picking them up, examining them. Um, which is a way to stretch out their little budget, but for us, it was like, this guy is 
the star of a hidden object game, or at least he thinks he is. He's just going around and t poking things to see what they do. In one scene, he would pick something up, and then he would take it to the next scene and drop it off and pick something else up. <laughs> so for all you hidden object game fans, go check out Resolution. Yeah, it's basically like playing a game while you're watching a movie. And right. it's much better written. <laughs> so we're just down to the triangle. Let's find out what we're hallucinating in color here. Ooh, it's this again. Oh yeah, we've been in this room before. Yep. Now, now we're I'm... looking for completely new stuff. Mm-hmm. Like uh, an alarm clock. And... Dolphin, shoes, axe. I seem to remember that there was an axe over this way. That's a hacksaw. Yeah, they don't... It doesn't look like they want us to give them a hacksaw. I'm also, I also like saw a pulley up there and I'm like, surely that's one of the objects we have to find, but it's not. It's not. Nobody uh, needs a pulley. Yeah, the pulley in the upper left is apparently not what we're looking for. Or the knife right below it. Hey, the cat's still in here. Oh, hi Hello, kitty. Cat. What else? Pliers, a ball, a doll body. We can see that really plainly. A washboard. Plunger, that's the, a washboard. A bathtub for the wa yeah. Yeah, washboard. What is this, like a, that's a little torch? Yeah, I think so. I think. And strangely, you're not looking for that either. No. Nope. Is string one of them? Thread? Yeah. There we go. A ball, how about that one? Yeah, the plunger is over on mid-lift. Yep. Nope. Dolphin shoes phone. The dolphin's gotta be drawn on dolphin's the wall Dolphin's definitely gonna right? be drawn, because if there's an actual living dolphin in here, I feel <laughs> ridiculous for not having seen it. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't looking for a vintage phone for some reason. <laughs> Hacksaw, they spring. To, they want us to find a tape measure in this mess? That's kind of a small object to be picking out of this garbage pile. Um, yeah, we know that pulley is actually a tape measure, just it's on some rope to make it look like a pulley. Oh, how tricky. Tricky, tricky, tricky. All right, dolphin Sh shoes. Shoes are over on the right by the broom. Those are some shoes. Yep. Shoes I can pick out. Dolphins, for some reason, don't stand out as much to me. Huh. <laughs> by dolphin, do you mean hippo? There's the pliers! Oh, you know what? We pulled back the curtain last time. Pull the curtain back and oh, maybe yeah, it's the... on the curtain. Oh no, we can't do we that? We can't. I think it's pulled back now. Aww. Well, so there... Oh, there's the dolphin. I was Aww. like, where are the other drawings? We knew where that one was. So we got thread and tongs. That's clearly not tongs. No. No, those are either pliers or a wire cutter. Yeah. Anyway, maybe those are exactly what we need to fix the triangle. Let's find out. Let's find out. Fix the triangle. Beat it with some tongs. Now, the thing that this wanted was a long, thin object to slip into. Oh, because we need to be able to the, turn the vise yeah, and get it out. Yeah, and for I don't some think we reason, one of those. we can't do that with any of the mini sticks. I mean, we could do it with this nail right here. Yeah, We could right? use the tongs, pull this out, and then use the nail. Try it. Maybe that's the thing. Give me the thing. No. If that was the solution, our narrator would have laboriously outlined it for us. Okay, swallow the gun. <laughs> if we can't do this simple task, we're leaving this planet. You are wasting time, protagonist. <laughs> oh no, I need a specific skinny thing. What was going on over here again? With oh, these tongs, I bet we can lift up this heavy thing now. Oh. And Put then... your hand on it. Yes! We've just <laughs> seared all the flesh off our hand. <laughs> you didn't. We didn't go find a glove. We are strangely immune to certain things. All yeah, right. we're the least capable man on Earth in most cases. But so then... even though this has been on top of some coals, we're going to use our bare hands and stick it in here. <laughs> now pick this up with your teeth, dummy. <laughs> and get to the hospital. <laughs> oh, I can see the metatarsals burned clear through. Was there something over here we needed to do again? Yeah, I wanted just to assemble a doll. I'll build a doll. We don't have anything for doll building. 
Not no yet. time to pick up another hobby. We're <laughs> supposed to be finding our kidnapped bride to be. Remember that? <laughs> Remember how we came to this dumb fog shrouded town because our fiance got kidnapped? Actually, she dragged us here to see her childhood home, and then she got kidnapped. That is one chill bird. <laughs> yeah, did, did not give a damn about any of these things moving. <laughs> All right, oh, there's so. the other doll parts. Great. Thank you, musician statues, for the gift of doll parts. Now, for no reason I can tell, we're gonna put a doll together. <laughs> uh huh. You you want us to really put the doll together? Yep. Oh god. All right. Here's a foot, and then here's a body, and then some hands. I'm an expert. And then a head. Now talk to me, weird doll. You gotta paint it with the varnish. Oh, this stuff. Yep. Now it's a little bit shiny, so that means it's done. Perfect. And now I gotta go put this dumb doll in the dollhouse and find out if that unlocks something. You know that the it's probably triggered by weight, and it could tell if it wasn't varnished because of the minimal <laughs> weight difference that varnish puts on a doll. Guide the man to the last room. Use your left mouse button to pick up items and then give them to the characters blocking your way. What? So, like, there's rum on the stairs that you So that pick goes up, to the pirate? And then you give that to the pirate. So he's he, bribed. Yeah, and then he sleeps and gets out of your way. And then we go and get the bananas. Yep, and, and now we're like, now, monkey. I'm, now I'm ready to meet this monkey, which yep, is all the way over here. You gotta go down the stairs so that you can go back to the left. Oh, oh wait. Now the flute is for the snake. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Go charm a snake. Do the thing. Doo -doo -doo. And then let's go back for the bananas. But there's an axe. Yeah, I don't think we're meant to axe murder the monkey. Aww. Or at least not on an empty stomach. <laughs> it's, it's Here, monkey, it's your last meal. <laughs> oh, no, the executioner needs, needs the hatchet for uh, his job. This is not wise. Don't give a strange person in a pointed hood a weapon? What the fuck? All right. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, flashlight, so we can go down here in the dark. And you are actually blind, so you don't need a flashlight. But okay. <laughs> I assume we bludgeoned a bat to death. Yeah, totally. So he really walked around this whole thing and picked up the cross that we could have picked up with our own. Oh, I forgot. We burned our hands completely off by <laughs> picking up a spit out of a fire. Yeah. So we pick that up with our mouth, because we couldn't have done otherwise. <laughs> and what is it? A crucifix. Yeah, remember she's in the church? Oh, right. This uh, this thing right here was showing us the church with the crucifix lock on the door. Yeah. Oh, do we even remember our way back to the church? It's not even a crucifix, though. It's a cross, because a crucifix would have the figure of Jesus on it. Don't ask me why I know that when I'm not even religious. Yeah, but keep in mind that with the Holy Trinity, Jesus, God, and the Holy Spirit are all one and the same, and the Holy Spirit is transparent, so he could be there, just invisible. Okay, you got me. Your superior Catholic upbringing strikes again. Are we really done? Because we've still got some junk. What, Like, what are we supposed to do with the stuff in... It's not this way. Oh, this is where the boat is. We're going to back down here. And then up here, and then to the church, and then we throw the junk in there. She's not going to be in here after all. I thought this was the ultimate destination, but we've still got shit in our inventory. Oh, cool. Whoever was making those uh, straw dolls uh, down by the boat area was also throwing some of them up here. The fisherman. Was it official that it was the fisherman who was making these dolls? Yeah, he left a note to himself. In Saying, his hey, pot. remember, I make dolls. Yeah. I need a star-shaped key. Do you? I don't think I have one. Why do you Why do you even need to get into that book? Just shoot it with a gun. Seriously. Hey, look, more coals. Touch them with your dumb hands. <laughs> I just need some incense. What? Hmm. 
Yeah, that's true. Sensors are used in I could use stuff. those candle stubs, but I need something for scraping them off the table. How about your numb, burned hands? <laughs> just, just lift them up. You actually could use thread for that, like as far as... Um, oh, like flossing them off the table? Yeah, like I've actually seen that recommended as a way to do it without damaging the underlying surface. But of course, that's not going to be the solution here. They're going to make you go look for something else. I guess that's true. <laughs> Why would that even occur to you, you weirdo? Uh, if I wanted to, I could really wreck this joint. <laughs> I mean, I guess why not? Everybody abandoned this place, but... I don't know. There's something down here, I guess. Uh, oh, boy. Let's watch another home movie. Look, there's only two left. This is the next to last one. When we entered the church, Tom was already there. He was sorry about what he'd done. Of course, Anne forgave her brother. Oh, this was about Suddenly, sicking the dogs on him. Stained glass window started to crack in the shape of a mask. It did what now? That's when the acid kicked in. Presumably. I don't even think that's how acid works. I'm just trying to explain how he forgot all this and. Uh, now I understand the mask is the source of everything terrible that has happened. <laughs> it darkened Tommy's heart and made him mean. I must destroy it. Hey, what made you murder him and drown him in the lake? Was that also the mask's fault? It's probably one of those other masks. There's a whole shop full of them. Oh, that's true. Maybe they were all evil. What's over here? Uh, another lock. Another key. Let's pick the lock with stained glass. Mm, should, should I try, try something, something else? else? No. I got a gun. <laughs> it's not the cure-all that I seem to think it is. <laughs> I mean, click that stained glass window in the back? Is that what we need it for? No. Wait, what was that? We used to marvel at how beautiful the stained glass looked as the rays of sun passed through it. Now it's faded. And it no longer looks like an evil mask, which was my favorite thing about it. <laughs> I uh, don't really see anything else in here. So we're supposed to wreck the floor at some point? Mm hmm. No, there's something else. Uh, we're just missing it. Oh, are we supposed to shoot the chain with the gun? <laughs> you think? I'm just blue sky in here. Sure, let's try that. Wha bam! Wow, we are maniacs. You can tell that I've played a few of these. Uh huh. <laughs> like, well, that's probably what the gun is for <laughs> shooting a chandelier. I mean, I knew you wouldn't use it for anything really useful, is the thing. Yeah, like scaring off a dog. Uh huh. So, if we ever get our hands on those impossible to pick up candles upstairs, <laughs> this is where one's going to go. For reasons. Yeah. Ugh. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, while we're down here, shall we disturb the dead? <laughs> Let's defile a crypt. Oh, it's too heavy to move on my own. If I could find someone else who has no moral compass, we could just look in here. Uh, why don't you wedge an umbrella in there? Why not? No. You are wasting time, that's true. What else? Is this also for the... Yeah, that's the crypt. Yeah, but there is uh, something on the wall on the right there. Maybe that's this thing? something? Yeah. Oh, you know, more places for keys. A lighthouse figurine. A lighthouse figurine. Okay. What's here in the water? Oh, they're so sad. <laughs> they're so sad about how someone used... It's hot? Your hands are already burnt. You can't feel Chris. anything with your hands at this point. Just put those nubs in there and get the key. Also, we have an umbrella. Why can't we just use the umbrella to divide the, yeah, the water? Yeah, that's pretty clever. Oh my god, that works! <laughs> You can never be too dumb to solve one of these puzzles. <laughs> I need to turn the water off. Or I could just use the tiniest umbrella in the world. <laughs> Did we get this out of a cocktail? Is that what I'm not remembering? And then we can get it back. <gasps> that never happens in these games. That's amazing. A reusable umbrella. Oh, I'm, okay. a, I'm actually kind Why of Why is impressed. this still sparkling? 
I might, might need, need hot water, water at some point. Mm. All right. We'll keep that in mind. So we have a key. What's this? Bes I'm going to steal that trident. Poseidon. Door is locked and it needs a shell. I don't have mm. anything like a shell either. Ha this is not a lock at all. This is 100% inlaid. <laughs> you can just grab the handle there. There's no indication of a locking mechanism. He's OCD and he can't move on until everything is set until to Until right. he's fixed the decorations That the actually place. makes so much sense as far as hidden object game protagonists go. Right, if they have some form of OCD. Can we not leave this room? Oh, here we go. This is how we climb back up out of the floor. <laughs> so we had a little key which probably goes over here. Yep. Let's try key. the hot water key. Try it a couple times. <laughs> and then go out through here. Oh! A whole other area. Wow. That's a pretty building, <coughs> whatever it used to be. Yeah, no kidding. So, some bells. According to this sign, the bell tower is just around the corner. According to your own eyeballs, the bell tower is straight ahead of you. <laughs> How about that, Sherlock? <laughs> All right, let's steal a kite. Cut the to... rope. You can't just enter the gazebo? You could hop that gate. He here. doesn't have knees, is oh, the problem. Oh, use, use the stained glass fragment. I'm on a roll here as far as dumb solutions. Use this as a knife? Yep. Wow. <laughs> Did you see that the roots also were keeping the door shut, but that doesn't slow them down? No. Wow, people threw a lot of garbage in this gazebo. <laughs> Wouldn't you? I guess. Uh, are we looking for butterflies, or... Hey, I bet we could open this, right? We are looking for three butterflies. There's a heart. Hooray. Okay. So there's one butterfly, there's two butterflies, there's three butterflies. Yep. What else do we need? Do we need a pigeon? We need a horseshoe. Okay, there's a horseshoe. What else? Arrow, fork, playing cards. Is that a playing card? No. no. I guess they want a whole deck of playing cards. I don't know. There's our fat squirrel. Slingshot, Lily, Fan. Fan Slingsh is right by there's you. There's a fan. There's a slingshot. The Lily is up and to the left. That's a Lily. Yeah. Who's got our playing cards? You look like a gambler pigeon. <laughs> no. There's a saw where someone just gave up halfway through sawing this <laughs> tree. That's kind of fun. Yeah. A brush, a shell. What is it? That's a star. That's the star we need. Oh, maybe that's what we're going to pick up when we solve this whole puzzle. Mm. There's playing cards right there. The brush is up and to the left there a little this, bit. There's a crazy straw arrow that's been drawn on. Oh, fake. A brush. Fork and a shell. Uh, fork and a shell. The fork is mid to the right, just a little bit at the bottom. See it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And a shell should be right there. No? That Georgia O'Keeffe thing isn't a shell? <laughs> no. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Chinese takeout. Nice. You know, we Pink gotta flamingo. be hungry after all this. It's behind the flamingo. Look behind the legs of the flamingo. Isn't that a shell? This giant thing? Yeah. Imagine the beast that lived in that shell. Hey, wait a minute. We need a star key. How come we don't grab that star? We got a shell and a fork. Aww. Well, the shell matches the basement. Yeah, uh, garbage. Freeze. Dumb thing. <laughs> I don't know what the fork is. Maybe it's to pry up those uh, candles we couldn't do before. That's Sh should we press on? All too likely. Uh, oh, Someone a threw bell. a bell down here. I'm afraid of falling. Well, that's sensible. Umbrella. We lost the umbrella. We picked they, the umbrella up again. Where'd it go? They even let us... Oh, that's annoying. Hmm. They even let us pick it up. Oh, well. Oh, it's because we had to get it out of the way, otherwise we couldn't get hot water from it later. Aww. It wasn't reclaiming the umbrella so much as opening up the water again. We picked it up and just ate it. And then yeah, just chucked it into the crypt. It's laying next to whatever corpse is under that marble. Oh, my God. Uh, do we have a bell? No, we just saw the bell, remember? And it, we can't reach it. All right. So I guess we don't get any farther until we figure out how to go fishing for the bell. Yep. So back to the crypt. 
Let's clamber down into these this unsafe hole and then go here. I'm so shocked they didn't make us go find a ladder. Kachunk. Anne was here. A masked man brought her to this place. He Keep put the second half out. of the pendant in this vat. Open the lid and take it. Why are we taking instructions from this hallucination now? Yeah, dead boy. This is a ghost, by the way. If somehow this is the first of these videos that you've watched, for one thing, <laughs> there's a whole story preceding it. You should watch the other videos first. But uh, to bring you up to speed, if you really don't care, this is the ghost of a dead young boy that we've been seeing in flashbacks. We watched him die, but he still shows up and helps us solve dumb puzzles. <laughs> It's in the vat. I need to lift the lid. Well, that's that's kind of what I meant by clicking on it. Okay, Over to so you gotta the, go. Yeah, okay. All right, so this needs to be connected to this. So let's connect it with a fork. <laughs> with thread. With thread. Very strong thread. I better not do that. Also, we need a lever. Oh, so much to do. So, need to attach the chain. Well, can we just grab the... No. Our hands don't work because we burned them with a red-hot skewer, <laughs> so we can't attach the chain. By the way, I thought your latest uh, theory was that uh, Anne, the fiancé's brother, grew up to be the, the fisherman kidnapper. Yeah. who has kidnapped her, and this ghost is actually like a guilty hallucination of ours. Yeah. So it's not really a ghost because he's not This is his dead. intuition. Right. He hasn't told us anything we couldn't figure out ourselves. Everything's coming back to me. We went to the secret chamber to get rid of the mask. But Tom went mad. He ran after it and fell through the floor of the dock. I wanted to help him, but I couldn't see through the fog. <laughs> what? You were not even trying. And your eyes had clearly gone evil. Yeah, got those evil eyes. Tommy died because of me, and the mask clouded my memory. Wow, he is really trying to put the blame anywhere but on himself. It was the fog. It was the mask. It was. It was so definitely Tom's not me murdering this boy. Fault. How could I forget that? <laughs> yeah, uh -huh. good question. We're all wondering. Now that you know the truth, Henry, it's time for you to learn who I am. Jiminy Cricket. <laughs> After that awful day in the secret chamber, you started to block things from your memory. Your home. Your family. This place. But when you returned to Riverdale, everything started coming back to you. I watched you recall your memories one by one as you wandered the uh -huh. empty streets. I was right. I'm simply the manifestation of your memories of Tom. Not actually a ghost of a you drowned boy. You can still boy. save your fiancé, Henry. Find the second half of the pendant and then go to the secret chamber where everything started. Goodbye. Why, why do we need the pendant for anything at all? Yeah. Besides the fact that our hallucination just told us to do it. Because our, our memories of Tom, right? He's our memories of Tom. Our memories of Tom are not good. He was not a nice kid to us. No, he was a jerk. So why would our memories not just also be fucking with us? They probably are. They're probably like, yeah, you need to go click on all these things instead of saving your girlfriend. That's totally what needs to happen. Okay, the string and the magnet are gonna help us get the yep. bell. Yeah, yeah. Do we know how to do the lid of the crypt yet? I don't no. think we do. We need like a crowbar or something maybe, or a pole. No, through the gate to get to that other place, remember? Oh, right, it was out this gate. That's my mistake. Yep. Well, we just got this passage opened up. Yep. After not having any new places right, so for quite a while. Thread, magnet. They don't really give you a combined inventory thing. No, you're just supposed to. They are, now uh, okay, it's you just do it. drop the magnet and then put the thread on. Yep, there we go. Now we got the bell. Threw out the string and the magnet. We'll never need string again in our lives. Nope. Everything for from now on is going to be easily within our reach. Raise and lower them to play the required melody. <laughs> huh. When the bell is raised where it belongs, the bulb under it will turn green. When it's close to where it belongs, it turns yellow. So this really is just a click through all the positions and then see where it lights up. I don't see this 
Oh, because we gotta hit a button to find the colors. Ugh. All right. So this one's close. Let's go here. Let's go here. Let's go here. Let's go there. So close. So that's the only place it could be. That's the required melody. Yeah, ting, 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 ting. All the same note. Top no. of the charts. <laughs> oh my god. What the god. hell is that? I've seen this symbol before. Have, Have we? you? It says, like, bell, 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 stick a bell in here. But I just <laughs> used my bell downstairs. Can I get it back? No, of course oh, not. Oh, boy. Everything is one use only in this world. What's up here? What is that? Is that uh, a crack? There are symbols on the inside of the bell. I need a stiff brush for scraping off the rust that's hiding them. Oh. This is like, you know, before email, people used to scratch notes on the insides of bells. Oh. Yeah, I heard of that. Mm. Okay. What is this? There's an actual real note here in the rope, but I guess we're not... Not interested. Not interested. If it doesn't require scrape and rust, I'm out. <laughs> well, let's go up here. Steal a hacksaw. Steal some rocks. Steal some rocks. Oh, incense. that's incense. Well, we know. Well, we know. Yeah, we know where that goes. So... Alright. Nice hanging out, bell tower. Look, it's happy we were visiting. Aww. Look at that big smile. Uh, right. There was nothing actually there other than telling you that's a bell tower. The so incense, is incense right there, goes yeah. over here. But why? Now I need to fan the coals. Why are we doing this? What is this for? I don't know. Maybe we take it down to the and wave it over the, to apologize for the body for the desecration you're about to commit. You know, you really can't use a fork to just scrape these candles up. I'm not surprised. No, I'm not leaving without all of them. <laughs> Especially since it says two of four. Yep. There we go. Alright. Jump back down! Let's... Oh, our knees are going to be ruined after this. Okay, we found a place to make candles, so we can't yet put that in there. So the candle making stuff was over here. So what we're probably going to do, stick wax in the top, take our smoking sensor in the bottom. Nope. For heat. Nope. And then hack our own hands off. <laughs> Cut our throat out of <clears throat> exasperation. But really, there's there's a heat source in here. Uh -huh. We should be able to put it here to make the wax. No. So why can't we pry open the sensor as a heat source. We're too dumb for that. We, especially now that we don't have the ghost that's not a ghost yeah. to tell us what to do. Like, that was the only, like, thinking, deducting part of our brain was, like, manifesting itself as Tom. And even Tom has gotten fed up with our stupidity and he's just fucked off. He's like, you know what? You remember things now and if you still can't figure shit out, then you just deserve to lose everything. We're supposed to go back to the courtyard. This is the courtyard, right? No, I think the courtyard was the other side. Oh. Yeah, it's the other side. You gotta go through the gate. This courtyard. This is a courtyard. It doesn't really so look like So there's something that we can do here? Supposedly. Is there nothing else shows up here, right? No. Oh, you need them for the to stick in that lock oh. up the Yeah, upstairs. so how do we get this off? With a hacksaw? Oh, here you go. Bing! Maybe there'll be a fire in the box. Just open it up and there's a roaring campfire and we can put Wouldn't that in. Wouldn't that be great? Yeah, why not just go all in with the surrealism of your shit? Put each part where it belongs. Hey, look, it's the evil mask. Ba -dum -bum -ba -dum. Yeah, definitely give that to the boy. That's what you want to Let's happen. see, this guy probably reads books. He looks like he reads books. <laughs> Nerd. Nerd. That's where that goes. 
yeah, who's use, eating an apple? Use the candle to set kid? everything on fire. Is it the apple tree? Yeah. Alright, there's another candle there. If there's a bird up on that side, there's a bird up on this side. If that's a moon, then this is a sun. And then one more star on the altar. Ah! It Bug infestation! You know, having it full of live moths is not any weirder than a fucking boring campfire, like I was saying. Well, the important thing is they're allergic to incense. Uh, Tommy I saw Benneth. this image in the lake house. I'm sorry. Tommy Benneth came to see me again today. He was very frightened. He said he wanted to get rid of an iron mask that had turned his life into a nightmare. He also mentioned a secret place at the lake house. Before leaving, Tommy gave me part of a locket that unlocks the room. He asked me to hide it. Did we? This is the first we've heard that the locket unlocks the stupid room. Yep. Now we know why we need it, I guess. Found a clasp. Oh, we just. There's take... totally no problem stealing a goblet from the church, right? No, of course not. That's not what got Jean Valjean in trouble. Do you think a goblet can be used to scrape a bell? Try it. Why not? Nope. How about a clasp? I mean, metal on metal? No, no, that's for the chain. Yeah, it's to fix the chain. You know, I just carry carabiners with me all the time. And I'd just like to suggest to this guy that maybe in the future, you know, consider it. Perfect. Now all we need is a crank. Yep. Do you have any memory of where this dumb goblet's supposed to go? Mm, no, not really. Maybe it's something to do with the crypt. Maybe we grab hot water. Oh, you're right. I bet we do this for the wax, even though that doesn't really make I, a lot of sense. If we don't use the coals that set the inf incense going here to melt wax and instead use hot water, I'm going to be so angry. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> No. <laughs> God damn it, no. I don't even want this candle. <laughs> Great, and now my OCD is assuaged because there's finally all the candles. Oh, hey, there's a bunch of crap. Okay, I actually kind of like this emerald uh, replacement eye. That's cool looking. Yeah, I like that. We, should, we have a fox skull, and we should consider that for ours. I don't know why you would mention that on a video. That <laughs> comes off as really creepy. Uh, so, let's see. There's supposed to be three mice in here. A uh, hammer, some string, a teapot. Oh, I see two mice. There's one at the bottom, kind of like... There's a shadow of one. That was one of them, and the other is at the bottom, kind of in that dark shadow between things at the bottom. There. A real live mouse. And then mm -hmm. there's this Mickey Mouse lock. No, there's a fake one drawn on the box. So two fake mice, one real mice. One real mouse. <laughs> Pearl necklace. Oh, they're calling something else tongs. These are actually tongs, though. So they got it right this time. Yeah, good job, writers. Finally. Translators? A lot of these I've noticed originate in other languages. There's the apple. They fake it so many times by putting drawings in here. Well, you know. Snake can, crown. They're trying to keep you on your toes. You know, there's not going to be a real snake either. What is this, a lighter? Oh, cool. Let's light this on fire. <laughs> Let's light this on. Light everything on fire. <laughs> Drag there's a candle everything. at the bottom. No! You dropped it. I dropped it? Oh, it went back into the box. Burning candle is one of the objects we're supposed to find. Is so, it? Yeah, there you go. That's not as much fun as lighting everything on fire and seeing what's left. <laughs> okay, can we open up this one? No. Nope. Can only open up one box. We need a teapot. I assume this needs to get out of the way or something. Teapot lower left of the shelves. Oh, yeah. Hey, this is a coffee grinder. Ooh, nice. And a gem. Take that, fool. <laughs> Angel crown he snake. Can just tell is this a snake. crown? Like on its side? It looks like a bell. Yeah, that's a bell. It's not hmm. a crown. The is this a right crown? There. Yeah. What else? What else? Hammer, string, angel, snake. This looks like a tiny hammer. You are right. 
strings. There's like a gold angel. coin that we're also not taking. What the hell? Yeah, we got some interesting priorities. <laughs> oh, another drawing of a snake. I told you there'd be no real snake here. Aww. This, is, this purple tube is nothing. Next you're going to be saying there's no real angel. No, that's definitely going to be in here. <laughs> Watching us this whole time. Look, a gravy boat. Do, 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 do. Fabergé egg, not interested. <laughs> there's the angel. Oh, yeah. That's, that's a cupid or like a cherub. That's not an angel. And then string. This taxonomy of heaven is inaccurate. String, it's right up there by the chest. There it is. Now take all the golden jewels back from the church. Those are tongs! <laughs> you just called them tongs! <laughs> Alright. Great. Alright. So now that we have tongs slash pliers, can we steal these gems? Nope. And we still oh. don't have anything that goes over here, right? Oh, lighthouse This is a lighthouse figurine. God, why? Why all this <laughs> stuff? Why all with the doing the things? Alright, so we need a lever, which we don't have. We don't have anything right now. It kind of used all our stuff and didn't give us new Wait, stuff. Wait, I just I thought I saw something there for a second. What's this? Oh. What is this? I have to press the images in a certain order. I guess from bear to... Do you think they would start with winter or would they start with spring? Start with winter. It's so we like go like less... winter, spring... What? But, and yet it's not... It says we have to press the images in a certain order and yet it's not... It doesn't think that them. we know what the solution is so it's not even going to let us guess. Uh... We just want to press buttons and it's like, nah, you, there's no way you'd figure out a four-figure sequence that's plainly based on the season, so uh... don't bother. And that's not the game. That's our protagonist who's just dirt stupid. Just a lead eater. Ugh. Like, I'd never figure that out. Yeah, even over and above the people of this town. At least they fled when the lead fog came in. He, I guess he left too. I'm, I'm being too hard on him. Maybe he was just naturally stupid over and above the poisoning that everyone was subjected to to make them dumb. That's the star we need. The, st the star we plainly saw and didn't pick up. Yeah. I bet we gotta go there, there again. There's something over here. And pick it up now. Oh, there is something. Oh, over there's here. our lighthouse. Oh, you need the tongs uh, for that. You mean the pliers? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> squeak, squeak. <laughs> what the? <laughs> it's like getting a cork out of a bottle. <laughs> sure. That's hilarious. Why are you going that way? That's it's not that way. Uh, the lighthouse is back one and to the right. Oh, out the gate again? No, you were right there. What? <laughs> By oh, the crypt this thing. over there. Right, right, right. I mean, there are so many places to put random bullshit. I hey, look at that. I understand why you're not... Creepy wow. little doll head with tentacles. There's all this cool stuff we see along the way that we can't take. And then he takes this useless crap. Yeah, stick that in your pocket, dude. No, go back. Oh, we didn't get to take the giant teeth. We didn't get to take the um, sinus diagram figure head yeah. thing. It's like, I know there's more room in our pockets. We've emptied almost all of our inventory. You could be stealing so much more if you had some ambition, Hero. If you weren't so tired out from dead ghost children. <laughs> all right, let's get in here. Grab the other half of the pendant. I better drain the water out. Just get a little wet to solve the mystery, you big baby. Uh, this is one of my biggest peeves in this kind of game, is that like you're you're supposedly after this urgent thing, like you're trying to save a life, you're trying to rescue your wife or your daughter or your husband or whoever. But you it's won't like, be remotely inconvenienced by it? Right, but you won't touch cobwebs, you won't like get, scratch your hands on thorns, you won't get your hands wet. <sighs> Watering can? Huh. Oh, that's a spade right there. Star, star. We can click on the star finally. Right there in the oh, water. Yeah. This time we can pick up the star. Yeah, that we knew we needed all along. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, a pallet. Where's that? A pallet, a watering. There's a watering can. Oh, yeah, nice. Uh, yes, dragonfly spade. There's a. A boomerang? Really? Huh. 
Lizard X. Do we need a ha don't need a hammer this time. Was that colorful parrot thing up there before? That looks new. Which thing? The colorful parrot right Yeah, there. no, that was there last time. Oh, I didn't notice that pinata guy. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Do they want a nutcracker? There's a boomerang. Oh, good one. Um, paper boots. need a compass? No. No. Wheel. There's the pallet. Huh? The wheel? Mm-hmm. Do we have to fold our own paper boat again like we did before? I feel like it's not letting me pick up this spade, and that is plainly the spade. Aww. That's a trowel. Um, paper boat over to the right of where you are? Mm. You see something made of paper there? That's a boat. That doesn't look like a boat. It doesn't, but I It's like it someone would. just crumpled it and threw it out. I guess this is also a speed. Yes. Okay. Alarm clock. Alarm clock is sitting right here to wake up the lumberjacks so they come back and finish <laughs> cutting this tree down. Where's the owl? I, I, I see the dragonfly. It's in the very upper right. Right. But the owl Do is... you think that this is an owl? <laughs> because you don't know the difference between tongs and pliers? Do you think that this hawk is an owl? No. Nope. Or this parrot? Nope. Okay, it's just they've started making mistakes. And it... No, I know. You You should definitely click on everything to be safe. I mean, we're playing... Do you think this flamingo is an owl? <laughs> we're playing on casual so we don't get punished for bad clicks. There's a ball. Alright, so if we don't see the owl, it must be drawn somewhere, right? Well, there's a drawn ram, but I don't really see any other drawings. Oh, wait, no, I, I do see it. It's drawn on the back slab yep. there. Wow. So, all that for the star we just could have picked up. Earlier. Because we saw it. The star is behind you, though. Yeah, how did I end up up here? Oh, well, we got to come up here anyway. Because now we got this scrub oh. brush to scrape off the rust. Oh. And now we have a clue as to what order the season's in. You were right, starts in winter. So. <sighs> yep. So we could have solved this, too. Yep. But at least you did some house cleaning first. <laughs> you obsessive hand washing, hand burning weirdo. <laughs> oh, I hate him so much. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like him even before I knew that he killed a kid. Honestly, that was a point in his favor. <laughs> yeah, that kid was pretty obnoxious. Even as a ghost, no redemption at all. As a memory. He's not a ghost, he's a memory. You you were the one that figured it out. Take credit for your own. Uh, what do you think? This upper, is spring? No, upper right. It's just, what? it's less light leaves to more leaves, I'm pretty sure. No. Isn't it? I'm pretty sure it's seasonal. Oh, okay. So it's like, you know, springs. Which of these is spring? This one? We looked right at it and didn't take any notes. Yeah. Okay, so to drain the water, you just take that iron bar out of there, and then we twisty this. They're broken, and, then... and we gotta replace something. These gauges show the pressure uh, in the pipes. One of, One of the... them is missing its pointer. That doesn't matter. Just twist the... Twist the knobs, dude. Ugh, he's the worst. He's It's his obsessive compulsive he thing. He refuses to just it. try something. Yep. Just try it. You know, the obsessive compulsive thing also explains why he won't just try a lock without already knowing the solution. Hmm. This, it, it explains a lot. They really should just say at the outset that that's your problem. All right, so... Um, the star was up in the chapel, so just go up. Up back, one more level. Yeah, and then to the altar. Up yep. here, that so one. we'll open this book with the star. Well, bam! Teach us all the things. <sighs> what? Oh, so uh, something in green. Someone tore out this part of the book. Need to find it. Several days ago, Tommy Beneth came to see me. He was worried about himself. He said he's been feeling mean and angry, which is unlike him. I told him it's adolescence. You're going through puberty. He has such a kind heart. Maybe he's just jealous because his sister has fallen in love and wants to spend all of our time with her boyfriend. No, there's nothing else here. No. Just the same single page. Oh, that was fun reading a priest's diary. <laughs> Now where do we go? We got a stick. Oh, a nice metal stick. Iron bar? Oh, for the crypt to, oh, the, to, to go desecrate, desecrate, the grave. desecrate the grave. Yeah, that reminds me. Who was buried down there? 
and do they look cool? <laughs> Can I touch them? We need a Halloween skeleton to decorate with, so let's uh, let's just use this real one. What was that about getting someone to help you? Do you just remember he has no friends? <laughs> I thought that was a head! Thank God it's only... Well, it's probably some saint's soccer ball, <laughs> which is why it's down here. So we grab the torn page, and then what is this? So now we have to go up and put together that... Gauge pointer. That paper before we can do anything with the pointer. So it's green, red, yellow. Yeah, but you gotta go up and put but it back But you gotta together. put it back in the book. Because what if that priest comes back and he's like, <laughs> who messed with my book? Even though it was locked. <laughs> really? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Green, red, yellow. Tommy told me he'd become even meaner. Even meaner than one paragraph ago? At first, he broke a ship and remained for Anne. Who's Henry? Who's Anne? Whatever. Then it's a diary. You don't need to give context for the characters for yourself. Uh, we saw clearly in the fisherman's hut that you have to write every detail and notes to yourself or you will forget everything that you've done. Don't live your life like a fisherman. <laughs> then he unleashed an attack dog on Henry and his sister. That was pretty funny. I prayed for him and gave him some holy water. Maybe the water will cleanse his soul of evil. What a great solution, priest. Don't talk to his parents. Nope. Just give him some holy water. Here, drink this. <laughs> or whatever. Or rub it on the mask or whatever. What are we doing? Oh, yeah, we're doing I'm Putting this. the gauge thing back. Are we supposed to do this and match it to the thing? What? match it to those oh you did you take note i didn't pay any attention to what these were supposed to be at yes okay good i'm glad you were paying attention i was too busy marveling over the crazy diary entry all right we got the two pendants now to go to the secret place first we've got to find a new thing what's a new thing what do we need oh this knife yeah to let's kill take the, the fisherman knife. Let's totally take the knife. We need to defend take ourselves and our fiance. Hey, there's that coffee grinder you wanted to click on. Yeah, before. oh, we get to keep the coffee grinder this time? Yes. Hooray! Hose, that's down on the barrel. Yeah. Oiler. Is that take it. Oh, we spotted that gravy boat last time and marveled at it. Oh, yeah. The oiler is down in the lower left of the shelves. Uh, the what now? The oiler. The oil can. It didn't. I didn't even get the hose when I was clicking at it. Oh. See the oil I don't know can. what I picked up. Oh, the padlock that was next to it. Mouse trap. There's a pickaxe. Right, right there. That's the pickaxe. Just grab it. Okay. That looks like a mouse trap right there. Yep. The chest you clicked on last time. It's up there. The whole chest we're taking. Yep. Great. Yeah, we're almost done. We're ransacking everything now. Oh, uh, now we're taking the diamond. Woo! Yeah, buddy. Henry, I'm starting to warm back up to you. Egg. I'm lying. I'm never gonna warm up to this no. guy. No. Uh, egg. hourglass to your right. Hourglass. The, the Fabergé egg. Oh. Uh, and oil lamp. Really, just which take, is supposed to be complicated. We take the coins and we are really in the. And then jewel. we're on top of everything. Yeah, we are in good shape then. Oil lamp. Like, is this the lamp? And then we need some oil. But they made us pick up the oil thing, so... Uh, I don't do know. Do we do something with the stuff on the right, because it's smoking? This thing? Yeah. I wouldn't think so. I'm just blue sky in. What is this? Oh, it's, that's oil. So we put that on the lamp. Oh. Oh, that's it's what the we were chimney for the lamp. Right, right, right. Pickaxe, hose, all the stuff we need to kidnap and murder. <laughs> so now that we're armed like a real psychopath. Uh, I, think, I think you mean rescue. We're going to go rescue, not kidnap No, and we murder. know the true nature of this character now. Oh, no. He let a little boy die. Okay. Yeah. This has all been like a, a rage hallucination of like she wouldn't marry him, so he's just gone on this complete tear. Hmm. He had a psychotic break. Oh, wait, we got to go back to the house. Yeah. It is the game is called the lake house, so I guess ultimately we are house. gonna have so to come back here. So everything ends up here, upstairs, and then where was the secret thing? Oh, it was. Let's just take a quick nap. 
It was downstairs, actually, right off the, um, right in here, the secret room. And then with the pickaxe, we gotta bust our way through this wall. And see if there's anything else worth stealing. Both halves of the pendant. Alright. Well, okay, I guess I see so, the outline. Right there. And then, like so. We're going into this confrontation armed with a hose? Yeah. Oh, we're and we're gonna use it as, like, scuba gear. We're so dumb. Hey, look. There's Henry. Hey, I'll be right with you. It's just, I think maybe there's something You're in this backpack. Late, oh, sorry. Henry. <laughs> I've reunited my family, and my sister will never leave here again. Yeah, we know. You're the drowned boy. Now, I'm gonna do what you did to me. I'm going to leave you here. But as an adult, I know how to swim, so it's really less of a... Are you surprised? Nope. Did you think I was dead? For a while, but then we put it together because Scooby-Doo style, you're the only other human being we've met in this town. We did meet, I was like, cast a ashore therapist. far away from here. When I came back, the house was empty. And I was naked. All of you what had was up with that? me. I'm sorry, Tom. I tried to help you, but the mask did something to me. Mm -hmm. You need to get rid of it. Still blaming the mask. Uh -huh. Please, Tom, throw away the mask. Did you even try that holy water the priest gave you? What, he just did it? That's all that he needed? Just oh, to yeah. be told? Maybe sometime in the last 15 years you should have thought about just... What? Uh, is he going to drown again? Are you, are you, get to, you get to do Henry, over, you get to rescue him this time. The mask is pulling me under. What? That's not how any of that works. What? Uh, here, you want a you wanna hose? That won't help. Help me. Hit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so uh, I guess we gotta we gotta MacGyver together something that works better than our burned and useless hands. Supposedly. All right, just hold on. It's just first I gotta. The key might still be in the house. We're gonna run back into the house. Wow. We are Look, the worst. You got a pretty good grip, right? Oh, I just I get really quick. Gotta solve all these puzzles, <laughs> and then I have to flip the light switch on and off ten times. <laughs> <laughs> or we're all going to die horribly. Oh, and then I broke this lever. I'm so sorry. Please hold on. <laughs> I know there is some sense of urgency, but it's just there's something over here I haven't looked at. And then I haven't touched this thing. And I have to put this in my pocket. Oh, remember the elephant thing from a million fucking years ago? This barrel still has some fuel. Great. Uh, I need a container. How about uh, a bottle? How yeah, about a can? How about a bucket right up there? Uh, nope. Oh my god, you're the worst, Henry. <laughs> I need a container that is not any of the three containers that are right here. Yeah. With an easy reach. How about you just, like, hold on to Can the just talk to her? end of the shovel and give him the other end and pull him up with that. Or the rope that is clearly in the oh, upper yeah, there's right. There's a rope right there. There's ropes all over the goddamn place in this scene. There's one in the upper left, too. Hey, wait a minute. Why is there, like, one of those Hollywood-style lights up here? The, That's kind of weird. Yeah, that is weird. Everything is weird. Go back and put the um, the elephant in place, I guess. What the fuck? I don't remember where the elephant goes. I'll First, I'm going to look through this trunk, though. <laughs> oh just God. real quick. No, just real quick. Oh, no. Don't lose your grip. It's just I have to find an angel, a dart, a shoe, an axe, a lace, a thimble. <laughs> just real quick. This is only going to take a second. I've already found the padlock. This is all coming together. Um, and then I found the cat. And then... The angel's right there in the middle there. There's the cherub. Oh my Christ! The and pirate. We finally get to click on that pirate. Nice, pirate. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'm I'm solving everything. I'm gonna fix everything. <laughs> uh, dart shoe. The There's bottle shoe. is kind of wedged back there. That's a shoe. Let me click on it. There we go. Bottle. Yeah. A vase. Boom. Wire cutters. Oh, they're right up front in the trunk. You what? were just hovering over them. I think those are wire no, covers? No, just to the oh, right. Oh, th those. <laughs> those are like pruning shears. I don't think you could... I guess you technically could cut wire with them. Yeah. Like tongs, pliers, whatever. Just anything with a hinge that looks like vaguely... They honestly have no idea what any of these little handle tools are for. Nope. Uh, there's the axe. So everything else is supposed to take a little bit more work. So... Dart and a thimble. I don't remember what we opened before. It was the drawer in the mannequin. <laughs> All right, such a which weird is already thing open. to say. Yeah, just duh. It's the, the drawer, drawer in the, the mannequin. mannequin. 
That's of course where the dart and the thimble are. <laughs> it's been a long game. <laughs> All right. Well, I got some wire cutters. So if I pretend to haul that guy up, I can always change my mind at the last minute and cut the rope. <laughs> okay, so the elephant is in this front room um, on the mantle. Not Not the portrait not of Anne that gives everyone the creeps. The, the mantelpiece has... There it is. Wow, I did not remember this thing at all. I played a lot of these games. A key. Key to the boat, I'm going to imagine. To the what? A key to the boat, I expect. What boat? The boat that we're supposed to lower down because he said something about lowering the boat. That's why we also need fuel. This is thing? To fuel this boat, yes. What? We're going to lower a boat instead of just lifting him out of there? Uh, yeah. That's insane. We are crazy. Every part of this I is told insane. you already. All right, where are we supposed to go now? We're in the right spot. So something that we've got is going to work here. We need to open his backpack. It's going to have, I guess, a container? Oh, that's right. I forgot the backpack was locked. So this specifically being a backpack key. Oh, Should is have it? Actually oh read my that. god. That's dumber than what I was thinking. Cool! A pencil! Really? That's Thanks, Snaily! That's all we get! And, nope. found and his diary. And found this mask in our house and gave it to me. She didn't know the mask filled people with arrogance and hatred. I tried to get rid of it, but it appeared in the house again and again. Well, he knew what was going on, and he didn't tell anybody, so they weren't able to help him. No, I still don't regret letting him drift away in the water. No. <laughs> Honestly, ha what he's turned into doesn't make me think that he was any sort of particularly redeemable. No. Also, his clothes were found, and that's why everybody thought he was dead, so... So he got naked as soon as he fell off into the water. Yeah, he's a little weirdo. I bet we're supposed to take the hose and then put it into the container that way, right? Oh... Uh... A place a gas, gas can, can specifically. Right, we're OCD. We can't just put it in a, a bucket. Well, there's we like materials, uh, safety, and security uh, directives that we have to follow. Uh-huh. Hey, is he fallen yet? No? Can we check on him? <laughs> Hi! <laughs> hey, how's, how's it going? Hanging in there? You know, this wire cutter would probably just take this <laughs> nail right off if we were to... No? All right, well, I'm going to go poke around in the house a little more. He could All pull right here. himself up with the net that is in the corner of that seat. Do we see, like, a... It's that thing over there. We're supposed to replace the lever, so I guess the pencil? Let's replace it with a pencil? Sure, why not? That does not seem sturdy, but okay. All the wires are disconnected. Do we... Okay, so we don't get any closer than this? No. Nope. I'm going to fix this from two miles back. All you got to do is match colors. How hard can it that be? That to that. This is the point where they're just like, let's just give them more shit to click on. We don't, let's not come up with any puzzles. Let's just, you know, here, match these colors, nerds. Yeah, what does this one do? It cl clicks to that one. Oh, I didn't see it was still sticking out. Yeah. Bong. And why oh, do we need boy. fuel for it? Uh, there's an outboard motor. It doesn't have a crank or anything and probably won't work, but... Why? Lifesavers tangle up in wire. Well, I have just the thing for wire. So, grab the lifesaver. Maybe this will keep him alive for a second. Hey, I gotta real fuel a boat real quick, but you can have this. What have I done? <laughs> I lived to take revenge on you. I looked for you for 15 years, and I thought I'd never find you. Then I up saw my your knee? wedding announcement in the newspaper. That's... I'm, I'm telling you, me. Tom. The mask did this to you. We need to destroy it. Lead paint cloud. Everyone Everybody is... so dumb. Everyone's real quick to believe this nonsense about There's the mask. There's no way to get rid of this mask. It keeps turning up in this house and spreading its evil. Here, it makes me talk take like the keys this. to the boat. We can use it to leave this island. Uh, okay. Boat key. So let's get some gas. It's a gas can and some hose. So he thinks the mask is magic and it keeps turning up in the house. Yeah. Why doesn't he think it will just follow us? You gotta click on the gas can. He won't or why it. hasn't he ever just left the house? He did leave the house. He was living in that hut. Why did it still follow him there? Like, if it followed him there, why wouldn't it follow him to where we're going? 
I don't know. It's going to be one of those horror movie type endings where like he's, gonna, everything's okay shows up now and on the him when he's shows. in the back of the boat. Yeah. <laughs> dun 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 dun. We hate you, Tom. Jump, 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 jump. And teleport. <laughs> and teleport after him. And then we see him driving the boat, but he's got the mask. And we see him objecting to the wedding, and he's got the mask on. <laughs> and we see him at the destination honeymoon resort, and he's got the mask on. That's a different woman. That's not the same girl. He married a completely different lady. Uh, what are we seeing? What are we looking at? Somebody picked it up? The end? Question mark? <laughs> he came back for it? We came back for it. Some someone came back for it. The 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 end, the end. Oh, there's a bonus chapter. Uh. uh no. No. <laughs> We're not going there. <laughs> All right. So we successfully solved the mystery of our own forgotten past, where we thought we let a little boy die, but he didn't actually die, and we don't have to be guilty about it because the fault was all with the mask, and the failures of all the other adults to properly deal with it including a priest who thought he could just throw water at a little child. <laughs> I guess technically that's what our protagonist tried to do. We threw a lot of water at that child. <laughs> so everybody left and then some strangers got married and someone else has the mask. The end. What a story. A story of industrial neglect and the poisoning of an entire town to make them all dumb as rocks. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's... I, I don't think there even was a mask. I think it was just the chemicals. I think it was a metaphor for capitalism. I, I think you're right. Join yeah. together, comrades. We have nothing to lose but our chains. <laughs> Down with the man. Well, this has been Michael and Amanda and the Lake House Children of Silence. We've made it out the other side, and so have you. <sighs> Thanks for joining us. We'll probably do something like this again, because we don't learn. <laughs> Bye, everybody. <laughs> <laughs>